Alrighty, we've got the beer, we've got the camera, we've got the set, we've got the action. Where's the light? We need some light. I've got an idea. Oh, check this out. Oh my God, that is bright. Holy dooly. The Kick-Ass Power Bank Torchlight. Let's talk about it. Howdy folks, how you going? Rob here. Welcome to the channel if you're new. Welcome back if you're a regular. Well, we're in Wanderer HQ. We've paid the power bill, the lights are back on. So let's have a look at the Kick-Ass LED Power Bank Torch. Uh, I've seen these around at campsites and things and thought this looks a pretty cool little unit. And I thought, I'm gonna get myself one. So you know what? I did. So it comes with the USB-C, the USB-A charge cable. And here's the unit itself. Nice little packaging there. Kick-Ass, well done. Take the little cover off. Bam, she's away, and we have the kick-ass LED power bank, power torch, power torch, LED bank torch, <laughs> LED power bank torch, well, let's go with that one, rightio, what do we got here, we've got a nice transparent LED torch and power bank all in one, obviously, comes with a nice little lanyard there, We're very, very nice indeed, and uh, a couple of little rubber silicone sort of circle ends on it here to stop it from sliding and slipping when it's uh, on a surface, which is really, really cool. A couple of magnets as well, a couple of little magnets there to help it stick to uh, anything magnetic. Anything magnetic? Yeah, that works. Or metal. Anything metal this thing will stick to because it's magnetic. When you pull it out of the box, folks, give it a good charge overnight. Eight to ten hours just to really get that charge in. It's like when you buy a mobile phone and, you know, it comes half flat or three quarters. Uh, worth the battery. They should You should charge it up overnight to get the best battery performance out of it. Now it is waterproof folks, up to about one and a half meters, so you can dunk this in some water or um, if it falls into the river or something like that, don't freak out, it, it will still work, as long as this end is done up. Now, speaking of this end, we have a glass breaker at this end as well, which is very, very cool. If you're uh, ever stuck in your four-wheel drive or any sort of emergency situation like that, you need to get out. Uh, there is a glass breaker, so you just hit the glass with that with a bit of force and the glass will break and uh, hopefully you can get out of the window. Uh, at the end of this thing, we've got the button to turn the light on and on, the torch on and on, on and on, on and off. And uh, what we do is we open up the end here, just a screw cap lid. And at the end here, we've got our two charge ports. So we've got USB-A and uh, USB-C. So you can charge with the tape cable included or if you've got your own, that's great as well. Now, how bright is this thing? She is 800 lumens. The torch end is 800 lumens, guys, which is pretty darn up there. It's pretty high. So you can get to about 100 meters throw on this thing. And uh, what we're gonna do is uh, put your sunnies on, folks, because here it comes. Bam! <laughs> yeah, there you go, guys. 100 lumens in your face. It also comes with other features as well. You've got eight modes on this thing. So you've got the torch. I won't shine it in your eyes this time, guys. I'll look after you. And then we've also got a low sort of uh, ambient LED light, which is pretty cool. A medium LED light, which is cool. And we've also got the super bright, which is uh, probably my favorite. It is unbelievable how bright that is on a dark night when you're out at camp and you've got that up underneath your gazebo or next to your car, next to your setup, whatever it might be. This thing is unbelievably, my God, that is unbelievably bright. So <laughs> we've also got the mozzie light. Now the theory is that the orange light, you know, keeps mozzies away and all that sort of stuff. I don't know if that's true. You tell me folks, have, when, when you run your orange lights at camp, do you keep the mozzies and insects away? I find that maybe the mozzies and insects stay away, but you know what this attracts? You know what I find this attracts? Spiders, wolf spiders in particular. Next time you're at camp and you're running the orange light, have a look around and see if uh, any wolf spiders are wandering around your camp. Anyway, I digress. We've also got red, and blue, so if you want a bit of blue ambient light anywhere. And then we have the party mode. Whoop, 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 whoop. Or some would call this the, the cop mode, so you could still go whoop, 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 you know, like a police siren or whatever. And uh, so very, very cool guys. If you've got a party mode or whatever, you can have a bit of fun at camp and you want a flashy, flashy light, you can, uh, you can put this on. Very, very cool. Very bright as well, as I'm sure you can see. There is a trick that you can do that a lot of people may not be aware of. So you can turn the light on, so you're on your torch or you've got your ambient setting, right? Uh, or you go into bed and you, the mozzie light's on. You can hold it down for a second in any mode, no matter where you are in the light, um, hold it down for a second and it turns off. 
Just note that it won't come back to where you turn it off. So if I turn this back on now, it goes back to its original sequence. So down the bottom there with just the, uh, the normal torch and then back through and so on and so on. Where do I use this light? Where do I use this kick-ass power bank LED torch? Now, I own a Oz10 Bunker Pro. I've just upgraded from the King's Big Daddy Deluxe. And the King's Big Daddy Deluxe, I used to run this lantern, right? It used to hang from the uh, little hook in the Big Daddy Deluxe there and I'd turn that on and she would be very, very bright. Nice little uh, ambient light hanging above me in the Big Daddy Deluxe swag. I've done a video on that one too. Check that out. I'll put the link up here and in the description below. Great little lantern light, right? But now I've gone to the Bunker Pro, the Oz10 Bunker Pro, which I absolutely love. Review on that coming very, very shortly. It doesn't have the hook loops, so I can't put the hook uh, up for the lantern. It has side pockets and stuff. So what I find I tend to do, grab this as I get into the Bunker Pro, turn it on, usually just the low, the low white light setting, and that lights up literally the entire bunker or the entire swag. It would light up the entire thing, even just on the low setting. I've given one of these away before. If you've tuned into a previous live stream of mine, I've actually given one away. I gave the short one away, the 162 mil uh, version of this. And to a lucky winner who joined me on a live stream, there was on a uh, recent live stream I did here on YouTube. If you want to be part of those sort of competitions, guys, make sure you subscribe, make sure you follow along. Um, Little competitions and trivia nights and stuff like that are going to be quite common on this channel and giving away little funky prizes like this one here. So make sure you subscribe and join in for all of that. The winner of that prize actually sent me some footage of them using it, so thank you very much. I appreciate that. Uh, so I'll chuck some of that up here. You can see them using the, uh, the party mode and just the general light and stuff to light up their camp. Very, very cool. I know they absolutely loved using it, especially the party mode when they when they discovered it had that. That's always, always a lot of fun. So let's get in to the nerdy stats. Let's talk runtime. For the torch, that one there, 22 hours. For the soft ambient light, you're gonna get from full charge 40 hours out of that, guys. How amazing is that? 40 hours. Let's go to the medium white light. You're gonna get about 23 hours, folks. 23 hours, which is absolutely unreal. And then the full strong light, you're gonna get a good 12 hours. I have fallen asleep in the Bunker Pro with this on full you know, after a few few tinnies, of course, and woken up the next morning, this is still on. This is still on full bright, This, uh, you know, because I've gone to bed at two and the sun comes up at six and uh, or eight or whatever, and um, I'm still in the bunker, you know what I mean? And I wake up and this thing's still blaring. So, <laughs> you know, the runtime on these is is honest, guys. It is true. Um, the soft, uh, sorry, the SOS, you're going to get, surprisingly, 26 hours out of that. 26 hours in that mode, which I find absolutely phenomenal. I look at that and think, geez, that must be smashing the battery, you know, because uh, there's a bit going on there. But uh, no, 26 hours. And the mozzie, let's get back to the mozzie for you. 13 hours out of that, guys. So well and truly a night's, a night's uh, camp you're going to get out of that. And uh, it does take a little while to charge. That's, that's not a downside, but it's just something to be aware of. So. If you do run it flat, especially before you go camping, charge it up the night before, guys. That's my hot tip, and you'll get through your entire camp, I reckon. I can't fault it. I can see why this is so popular on the Kick-Ass website, guys. I wish I got one earlier. I waited and I waited. I saw heaps and heaps of people already buy them and using them at camp. I'd walk around, see everyone with these lan lamp lanterns, with these uh, torches, especially with the party mode going. I think, damn, what's going on over there? What's, what's this? Finally picked one up for myself, guys. Absolutely love it. Recommend it to absolutely everybody. And uh, the next the next live stream I do, I'll probably give away another one because they're a popular, popular little unit and uh, I absolutely think they're, they're fantastic. So, the Kick-Ass LED Power Bank Torch. Get yourself one, guys. They retail for about $50, $60, something in there. You can get a pack of $69, I believe. I could be wrong. Check it out on their website. Not 100% sure, I think it's about 50 bucks for the big sucker. Money well spent, this torch is fantastic. Even around the house here now, guys, at Wanderer HQ. So there you go, guys. The Kick-Ass LED Power Bank Torch. Get yourself one. Get on to kickass.com.au. I think that's their website. I'll leave a link in here or whatever. Um, not sponsored or anything, unfortunately. I love it because these things are fantastic. But uh, no, guys, get out there, get yourselves one. It's well worth your money and your time. You won't be disappointed with this torch. More camping trips and uh, campsite reviews and things coming your way. Big trips this year. Make sure you tune in. Make sure you subscribe. And uh, don't forget about the Instagram as well. Give us a follow over there. Come say good day. Love to have a chat to you and uh, see what you're all about and get to know you all. 
Until the next one, guys, get yourself a kick-ass torch. These things are kick-ass. All right, guys, we'll see you on the next one. Hooroo. Cheers.